Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a trackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-calibre meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction, and hopefully the style of contest. We're underway. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Coutinho. He's a, a real magician with a wand of a right foot. His control is, is brilliant, and he can pick out a through pass with the very best. It has a hit! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? And it's Memphis to Pai. Llorente concedes a free kick for that. by a great piece of goalkeeping. Well, I thought his starting position was good and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Now it's Memphis to pie. Good ball. It's a brilliant interception. And that's a goal kick. Stefan Savic. Hoists it forward. Chip through. Striding forward, facing goal. Forward it goes. That has put a stop to that. Dashing forward at pace. He's had a shot! A oh, great save, real class. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Oh, smart save. Just brushed off the ball there. Tries to get it forward quickly. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Luis Suarez. Chance! There it is! There is the breakthrough! 
And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again. Madrid take the lead and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on Llorente just wouldn't be beaten there looks to clip it forward and it's got through crunching tackle shot a goal cleared without complication needed to be better than that and he knows it and here's Suarez Carrasco Jeffrey Condogbia. Madrid. Oh, very much in charge here. Do Hits one! A real chance and a real let-off. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Coquet. Floats one over. Knocks it away. Oh, good ball. He's, he's gone for it. He's scored. They have hauled themselves right back into it. Ah, oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Barcelona grab the equaliser and we're all square yeah for me both sides are strong and well matched and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now Llorente is the guilty party there and it's Roberto gets it back Barcelona couldn't do a whole lot with it there. They could do with more sharpness in their passing. Going through. Condoglia not easily shrugged off the ball. Memphis Depay. Well weighted. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Jeffrey Condoglia. OK. Llorente. Luis Suarez! Marvellous goal! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
Madrid go into the lead. The ball's loose, and he's after it. Savage battles to win it back. Gets the better of his man. And he's there to clear it. He's gone for it! Oh, that's a terrific save! For... And the half-time whistle goes. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it's still anyone's game, as, as both sides have shown they have goals in them. As for the next one, should it arrive, um, that may have a bigger bearing as to who emerges victorious. Madrid leading by one in a finely poised game. It is intriguing to watch and could easily go either way. So we're already into the second period. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Gets away from his opponent. It is quite a run he's making here. Lovely bit of skill. Koke gets it away. And here's Coutinho. He's had a look. Longley. That's beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is ex up for the header. That's a half-decent try. Philippe Coutinho did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frightened of people getting in behind. Tries a shot! Decent hit and on target. Kontopia. Goes for goal! It's in! Two up now and they are cruising. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Well, everything is going to plan, Peter. A day for a, a regular managerial heartbeat, at least for one. Played out to the right. What a throw in. And it's Koke. It's Koke! Just off target. Well, to put it this way, he's probably made better decisions. Jimenez. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Yeah, and having notched the goal already, Peter, he's not going to be allowed to run off the shoulders as much as he'll want. 
good challenge, he just stood firm. Ball through needs to be good here. That's and the finish! Yes! And they are cruising away. Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. It's starting to look like a done deal now. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Eric Garcia. It's being played forward. Jimenez goes back to base. Koke. Longley drives it forward, and here's Depay, and helps available out wide. And here's Roberto. Well read, he sorted that out. Jeffrey Condobia, Luis Suarez, Carrasco. He's got away. Oh, he's found him in space. Shoots! Oh, that is an awful miss. Well, his reaction to that was ultra sharp, Peter. His anticipation is in fine working order. it out to the flank. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Danger averted for now. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Five minutes remaining now. Kondogbia, who does have an assist to his name. Longley. Eric Garcia. And it's played forward. Out to the right. That's a decent ball. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Barcelona seemed to have chosen a tougher route through the middle. That was easily read and dealt with. Nicely controlled. That's Carrasco. Forward it goes. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Madrid have won big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Madrid certainly produced a, a lovely blend of flair and industry to earn a result that was fully merited for me. So thank you very much, Jim, for joining me. That brings us to the end of our coverage. So from us both, 